Can you start off with your name, title, and company, please? So my name is Omar Shalabi, and I am the chief of the managed care population health for the central and eastern area in John Hopkins Aramco Health Plan. And um, wh why did you come to the conference today? Actually, I came to the conference because I have visited the United States last year. I was invited actually by uh, the team of the uh, Medical Tourism Association during their visit to Jordan while I was attending a conference over there. Uh, I made a few comments related to the GCI accreditation when they invited me. Uh, I came over and uh, it was my first actually uh, knowledge about the Medical Tourism Association <coughs> and uh, they have invited me also to participate actually in this conference. So I am coming actually in response to their request and also I am quite interested in the Medical Tourism Association. And um, what did you want to achieve today with the conference? Why I, I want to achieve actually the issue related to what I call controlled medical tourism. And this concept actually requires that patients deserve actually a help of a body that looks at the care that they are receiving away from their, their, their home, homeland. Uh, regarding the services that they are receiving, the approval of the services, and to make sure that whatever provided to them from the medical point of view meet the quality and the safety of the care and it shall be patient centered. I want to help you know patients like worldwide in working with people to develop policies to support this goal. And, um, what can we do to improve your experience next year? Actually, you are doing a lot of great things, actually. Your arrangements are actually extraordinary arrangements. <coughs> Uh, the places that you are choosing are quite interesting. Uh, people are feeling, you know, uh, relaxed. Your schedules are, are actually, you see, uh, uh, well respected by, by the people. I want in the future that when you invite somebody really to make sure that he is committed to come and he make, you know, the arrangements ahead of time so as uh, not to lose, you know, experts that can help this industry by their uh, experience. Who would you like to meet while you're here at the conference? Actually, for me, I would like to meet people who are interested to provide the best possible care to the patients. And I know that, you see, here there are insurance companies, there are hospitals, people are marketing actually themselves. But really I would like to meet with people who are not only interested in business and how much money they will get, but people who are interested to improve the quality of care and the safety of care because of my ethical commitments actually towards patients. Sometimes patients, they lack the medical knowledge, they lack what is required from them, and they may find themselves in situations where the care that is provided is not as they are expecting, and also the money that they are paying for the service is not more than the service that they are having. And um, finally, uh, what is the best piece of advice you've ever been given, but did not use? I am not sure about that right now <laughs> to give you actually an example. It is not but easy. for sure, as a human being, you know, and at certain ages, especially at young age, we are given some time advices, you know, from our parents, 
we may actually neglect them and we realize that when we become older and we have children that you know our parents were right at that time and we would be in a better situation if we listen to them. I cannot give right now a specific example, but I am seeing it in my kids when I am trying to give them an advice, sometimes they don't listen. They realize after a long time, you know, that what was provided to them was the correct at the time. All right, thank you so much for your time. You are Appreciate welcome. it. You are welcome.